Hi everyone, Petal is less here. Welcome back to my channel. I'm coming on to share with you guys a glam vase decor for the spring summer of 2020. Yes, a uh, nice decor to spruce up your home. <laughs> like I said, the spring is coming and we all want to glam up our home a little different. A little nice decor, a little touch here and there. So I'm going to share with you how to make a glam vase today. And here are the items that we'll be using for today's DIY. And everything will be listed below in the description box of where I got everything. So you guys can go down there and check it out. And if you're new, welcome to my channel. Thank you for stopping by. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button on your way out. <laughs> and hit the bell so you'll be notified every time I upload another DIY to share. And to all my oldies and goodies, thank you for stopping by and seeing this DIY that we're going to do for today. All right, everyone, let's get started. All right, everyone, we're going to start with painting our tall vase that we have here. And we are just going to use some white paint. And we have our little paintbrush here. So I am just going to shake up the paint and then we are going to just throw the paint inside the vase yes i'm painting inside the vase <laughs> now i am using um acrylic paint but you can spray paint inside the vase if you want to i, I just don't want to go outside right now and spray paint because the fumes bother me so that's why i'm just using the paint and paint the inside of our vase now I am going to do one coat and let it dry and then I will go back over with another coat. So two coats I think should be okay. Let it dry in between each coat you guys. Okay, now our vase is all dry. It is the next day. I left it to dry overnight. Yes, <laughs> so it's all dry now. So now we're going to use these strips that I have with the bling um what is it called again the rose gold bling wrap from totally dazzled yep i'll be adding these strips and i'm using the hot glue and again you can use any adhesive that you would like to do for your project yes so i'm just going to glue the strips going down with a slant each strip with a slant going down our vase yes <laughs> Now for each strip that I put down, I am just eyeballing it. You can measure the strips in between if you'd like to, but like I said, you know me, I always just use my judgment by sight and that's how I do my projects. And here is our vase all done up with the strips. I did the strips going right around like I told you with a slant and that's how it looks so now we're gonna use these bling gems here and we're gonna do them going down following the strips and I'll be placing a glue at each end of the strip one on top and one at the bottom that will hold it in place I was gonna do just one strip of the bling going down, but now that I'm looking at it, I think it would look nicer with a strip on each side of the rose gold. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm going to go back in like you see here and add another strip going down so it's one on each side of our rose gold bling. Now I thought the camera was rolling you guys when I was putting this down. I swore I pressed record but obviously I didn't. So I did one row 
with these gems, stone gems here that you can get from the Dollar Tree. Or if you're here, you can get them from Dollar Tree or Dollarama. They both have them. <laughs> so I just did one strip going down. So I'm just going to do another strip to show you how it's done. And again, please use any adhesive that you would like to use. I'm just using my hot glue. And here's our finished look, you guys. OMG, doesn't it look cute? <laughs> And nice refreshing home decor for our spring summer of 2020. Yes, I think it looks nice. It's a glam vase. I think it turned out very nice. I had the idea in my head. And you know, it looks very it looks way better in person. Yes, it does. It looks way better in person. And I love how it turned out. Using items from the Dollar Tree and the dollar store and from totally dazzled yes our rose gold bling wrap from totally dazzled <laughs> see it's so easy to take simple things and turn it into something glamorous oh i think it looks very nice super cute decor Here I placed it on the floor beside the couch because you can use it as an accent piece. Yes, and I think it looks very nice. A nice and glam piece of decor to brighten up any spot throughout your home, wherever you'd like to place it. I think it will look absolutely beautiful. And here it is on the coffee table. I think it looks very nice here too. Again, using it as an accent vase, it looks very nice. And here it is with some flowers inside. I think it looks absolutely beautiful like this. This is how I love it. <laughs> with the flowers inside, you can place any kind of flowers that you like, any colors to suit your home decor. But I think it looks lovely and fresh for the spring with the flowers inside. Absolutely beautiful. I love the vase with the flowers inside and I love how the vase turned out. Yeah. <laughs> Painted white and then you put the, the glam gems on the outside. And you know you can paint the vase any color you like. Yes you can. It would look nice in other colors too. And then you add your bling to it. It looks very nice. I love it. I think it looks absolutely beautiful. <laughs> Alright everyone, tell me what you think. Do you like it by itself as an accent piece? Or do you like it with the flowers in it? <laughs> and where would you place it within your home? Leave me a comment down below and tell me the answers to those questions. Yes. <laughs> I love it as an accent piece by itself and I also love it with the flowers inside. I think I'll be leaving it right here on my coffee table for a spring refresh decor yeah <laughs> all right everyone thank you so much for coming on and seeing the diy that i had today and please remember to hit that subscribe button if you're not subscribed and hit the bell so you'll be notified every time i upload another diy <laughs> and like i always say remember to stay blessed from petal is blessed and i will catch you on the next one Bye-bye, everyone.